Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 7th of August 1964, the Gulf of Tonkin Resolution was passed by the United States Congress. The joint resolution granted powers to President Lyndon B. Johnson to use military force to assist countries in Southeast Asia that were facing so-called communist aggression. Many critics of the war condemned Congress for granting Johnson a blank check to escalate American military involvement in the Vietnamese conflict. At the time, however, it was passed unanimously through the House of Representatives and only two senators opposed the resolution. The resolution itself was a response to the Gulf of Tonkin incident that had taken place just a few days earlier and in which the North Vietnamese Navy was blamed for attacking US ships on two separate occasions. While it's accepted that the USS Maddox did exchange fire with three enemy torpedo boats on the 2nd of August, the claim that it was attacked again on the 4th of August is now known to be false. Even at the time, it was acknowledged that the second attack may not have actually happened. Captain John J. Herrick, the commander of the Maddox, had spent four hours firing at enemy ships that were picked up on radar. However, he sent a message just a few hours later, saying that no enemy boats had actually been sighted, and so the radar may have been malfunctioning in bad weather. However, the President himself was not informed of this before he went on television to announce that US ships had been attacked. Johnson's desire to retaliate led to the resolution, and this in turn led to the USA escalating its involvement in the Vietnam War. <laughs> 